Hello, YouTubers. Someone at your studios here with a very spoiler review. So, if you do not like spoilers, please leave the video right now. And, well, um, it's a review on a mock, but it's all new and all, you know, breathing and all. Here she is. Yeah. That is to a crystal. No, I'm just kidding. No, it's uh, actually to a Coretta. In her, um, 20.8 and her how she how she was supposed to look like form uh yeah all of the mocks have been revamped some drastically others not so much uh if i would have to consider i would have to consider she is a drastic change not just by appearance or anything but also by weaponry and stuff uh, but, uh, yeah. So, let's go first with the head. And, as you could see, I took most of the gold off, which is good. Uh, it's just a regular Metru head with, uh, hair. And a gear right there that, supposedly, what I thought was supposed to represent a scrunchie. But, sadly, it failed, so... But I still keep it there, just, you know, because it looks alright. Uh, the body. The body, yes, it doesn't look like it changed, but actually did change in some ways. Uh, obviously, they're no longer silver, they're white. New lower um, armor piece. In the back, nothing changed, really. Pretty much the same. Uh, the arms. Just pop it out. It is changed a little bit by that little piece right there. Basically connects the whole arm thing. Armor and uh, yeah. And I'm trying to do this with one arm. Legs. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Uh, they have changed as well. Uh, the color and the foot. Not so much of the appearance or whatnot. You know. As you can see, these I just put them for no reason whatsoever. The little ball things. I guess they were supposed to represent like heels, but uh, yeah, that didn't work well. Um, and yeah, this piece right here, it actually does have a reason, but I don't want to spoil it. And it's already spoiled as it is already. Um, she actually is still the same height. Uh, if you're wondering what is her weapon, these are her weapon, which are the Krika blades. And you're saying, wait, what? She has, um, blood? Well, no. She actually has fire. And the little red parts, that's supposed to represent fire. So, yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, but yeah. Yes, her main element is fire. She doesn't have magnetism no more. But that's because of another reason. Uh, you may think she has ice. No. The white stuff is still fire. It's just like the intensity. So most of it is pretty... Pretty, you know, high. On intensity of fire, so... If she could want, she could destroy the whole world as we speak. But she's not an evil person. Um... She's the height of a normal Toa. Excuse me, guys. 
I have to fix her. Uh, but yeah, she also changed, um, what's the word? Uh, her story got changed a little bit. See, that's why I haven't post posted no stories yet for any of the Toads or Villains. Because I'm still working out on the shitload of storylines that I'm thinking of. Uh, sorry for the uh, cursing, but, you know. And I'll quickly do a height compression with another spoiler um, thing. Here it is. As you can see, she is about the same height as her boyfriend. And yes, it is who you think it is. But he has a new name now, so I'd rather not, you know, spoil the name. Um, and uh, yeah, he's changed a lot as well. Not drastically, but you know. Like right here you have the jetpacks, less armor. New method of putting this in. The back, quickly to show you the back. Wings. But overall, um, yeah, this is a spoiler. I was actually going to do this in January, but, you know, give you guys a little treat, a little uh, heads up on what's going to happen. Yeah. Um, she also um, has a brother now, and that will not be revealed yet, so yeah. Stone Nitro Studios signing off, and not goodbye. Not goodbye yet. Uh, there is one more thing I wanted to talk about. And... Did I find it? Uh, or, you know, we'll just use this guy as an example. Uh, yeah. Do you guys think this is a good look for... Uh, the unknown fighter guy? Because remember, Hotshot isn't his name anymore. That was his code name. He actually has a name now, but, you know, I'm not going to spoil it. But do you think this is a good um, look for Hotshot? Yeah. And I'm having a problem. Should I uh, use the Tahu Stars mask or this one? The Jala mask. But yeah, that's pretty much it. To Vanessa Studio signing out. Uh, you know, just a quick look at the set where I'm going to be making a lot of things. And goodbye.